Hi everybody! It looks like you really enjoyed uh, last time's video on uh, the first Rush Busters miniatures, so we decided we'd do another one with the minis that you haven't seen, well, almost all of them, uh, which are the not of this earth uh, minis. So I wanted to let you see uh, how impressive it was with almost all the minis. And I'm saying almost because you don't have the Experiment uh, 601 mini. Uh, and you don't have uh, some of the of the minis are still uh, coming soon, but you still have a good idea, a pretty good idea of what we're gonna have. So we're going to focus this time on uh, not of this earth. But before that, I also wanted to show you the player dashboards that you haven't seen. So look at how great they are. They are they look awesome, and. So here is uh, when, when you put cards and tokens in it. We received a French prototype, so this is in French, but of course you'll have uh, this in English as well. All right, so also we've received uh, the, the mat, uh, the Rush Busters mat, which looks great. Uh, so there's this image that you could see from, from my side, but even on the other side, it looks great. So Yes, I wanted to have everything. Uh, it's big, uh, it's, uh, it's good quality. You have some spaces where you can put uh, uh, the alarm cards, the spawn cards. Uh, here you have like the, uh, uh, the enemy cards. It, it, it looks great, it looks great. <laughs> yes, so yeah, you could add every single map will fit on it. <laughs> For those who are asking because in Joan of Arc, not all of them uh, fit it, but in this one, it does. All right, so also, before we go on Not of This Earth, let me show you uh, the incredible Project X that we received. This is the plastic one. Look at that. Now, this is absolutely incredible. This is fully assembled. You don't have to do it. I can tell you that it weighs a lot. It's very, very heavy. And it's super, super impressive. It's absolutely incredible. <sighs> you know, this is one of the most impressive minis that I've seen. It really is. Uh, let me show you next to a, uh, a normal sized mini. Let, let's show him next to Claudine. And then you will see the size of this thing. <laughs> this is Project X, uh, so this is a special uh, uh, expansion that you could buy. So yeah, we'll put him here. Now, let's start with the nut of this earth, because we started with the big things. Let's go big again with, and let's start with uh, the Shrieker. So the Shrieker is one of these awful uh, uh, creatures experiments, uh, you know, he, he, he's super big, he goes fast, and when, when he appears, you, he, he screams, of course, uh, hence his name, and when he appears, you will be <laughs> afraid. So yeah, the Shrieker, again, uh, next to Claudine, so you can see uh, a size comparison. Yeah, really, really big and nasty. <laughs> Uh, again, uh, some people mentioned, are we going to have these colors for the heroes? No. We're going to have a brown khaki uh, color, much better than this mustard yellow uh, color. So we're changing this. This is the first thing we received and then, you know, we make some changes. Uh, uh, Red Hawks and I, uh, gun will be straight, it won't uh, shoot in, uh, uh, in the air. So we are fixing a lot of things and we will receive the final minis. If you want, we will show them to you. All right, because we are showing you big things, let me show you again, uh, well, show you for the first time, uh, the, the alien, the big aliens. So we have the Ausgeburt and the Augenmutter. So this one is a, a psychic one. And this one is a predator. It's, uh, so this one is blind and he's using uh, the Augen uh, little minis to 
yeah, to detect and yeah, the the preys, and then he will go on on them. These aliens uh, can wield naturally the real energy. This is why uh, the Nazis are so interested in knowing them, and and this is why they went to the other well through this portal to the other side of, of the planet. Uh, they want to know whether they could uh, they could use this real as, as well because it's difficult and dangerous and unstable energy, and they can use it effortless. So we want they want to to know more. I was talking about the portal, so yes, let me show you the portal. Yeah, you can see, yeah, they, you see these are all assembled, everything, it's all in plastic, everything is, so these are complex minis to do, but look at the result, it's, it's pretty amazing. Really, really amazing. Let me show you the portal. So you know, uh, if you saw our videos uh, introducing the Not of This Earth, you could see that uh, they saw some portal appearing, but it was not stable, uh, so they couldn't go through it. So they built this device around it to stabilize it, which and this allows them to go through it and they will enter uh, another world. They will go to another world. And this is uh, the theme of the expansion. You go through this portal and then you arrive somewhere else. Let me show you. Yeah, this, this portal will be used in the game. Uh, sometimes you have to find where the portal is uh, during the, the mini campaign uh, from Not of This Earth, which adds to the, the whole campaign uh, in the game. And of course, you then can also use all of the minis from the Not of This Earth expansion in the raid missions. All right, so I show you first uh, the, the, the alien. Let me show you the little alien called uh, Decliner. So these go with uh, the Ausgeburt uh, creature. You see, they are all very small. And they are a pain in the ass, I can tell you. We've played with them every time they were here. If you could see the video, the None of This Earth uh, video game, you will see how they play. Uh, so yes, here they are. So they're small and they will go with the uh, Ausgeburt uh, min miniature. Uh, alien type. We do not have, unfortunately, uh, the Augen, the other little mini uh, minis for, for the alien, little alien minis. We do not have them. We will receive them very soon because we had to fix some things, so we didn't receive uh, them. There were some problems, but we will have them. So just imagine that on top of these ones, we have the, uh, the other little aliens from uh, the uh, corresponding to the other uh, creature. Uh, all right, so let's see now some Vrilmeisters. One of them is called Dr. Kopf. So Dr. Kopf, you will see in, in the campaign, I'm not gonna spoil too much when you do the campaign, you will see that you are trying to reach and interrogate uh, a scientist, a Nazi scientist who knows more than the others uh, about uh, the aliens. His name is Dr. Kopf. But Dr. Kopf escapes and then he turns into something else. Well, I'm spoiling a bit, but <laughs> I don't tell you everything and you will see when you play there are some, uh, yeah, some twists uh, that you will, you will see in the game. Uh, this is probably one of my favorite minis uh, from the game. This is, yeah, this is Dr. Kopf. And so he has somehow hybrided uh, with an alien. Well, you recognize the Ausgeburt alien, and now he can, he's just, th this mini is absolutely incredible. Uh, look at the, all the details. So this is the first new Vrilmeister uh, that you have in the expansion. Then we have another one called Hugo Hender. So this is a missed experiment. So they try to do like super soldiers and the, well, that means much bigger soldier, like with big arms and like strong and, and huge, but it failed on him, on Hugo. And now look, he has four hands instead of two uh, and his face uh, melted. <laughs> He's uh, like uh, kind of a red skull, uh, 
that you could, uh, yeah, you, you, you can imagine see where we got the inspiration from, but he's still a, a different, so he's huge, he's a different uh, character. He's huge, again, let me show him next to Claudine, you will see how big this guy is. Now, uh, let's see, yeah, let me show you in, in different angles. You see, from behind. Yeah. And same for this one. Yes. Yeah. Brilliant, brilliant. Yeah, they, these are great. Let me show you some other big guys. Uh, well, the big guys we have, we had some new Uber soldier, Uber soldaten, uh, super soldier. Uh, and these guys, we have these two guys that look awesome. Like these are successful super soldier experiments. So they tried to create some super soldier. They failed sometimes and finally, uh, eventually they, they, they succeeded. And you have this one, uh, these two ones. So they are really elite uh, creatures, uh, elite soldiers, and much taller than a normal soldier. And these one have uh, a sword and a, and, and a, and a real powered uh, heavy pistol. Let's, let's look at them. Let, let me put them in two different angles. And again, let's see how big they are compared to a normal sized human. Claudine is my favorite Reichbusters, one of one of my favorites. <laughs> Not only because she's French. <laughs> we have some other ones using a super big, big miniature uh, weapon. Uh, you see, he really he even needs a, a, a someone a henchman to to help him. And we have two of them. Look at look at the details on these ones. This is still from uh, not of this earth. Let me put them here and let me put, yeah, you can see and let me put the other one so you can have, like, yes, you can see two of them from different angles. Then we have uh, the alien handlers. Uh, so some of them, you know, when the, the, the Nazis uh, brought back uh, the aliens, they realized that they were not, uh, you know, pets. <laughs> they, they didn't behave, uh, so they needed some weapons to, real weapons, uh, to, to control them. So we have these guys who look awesome. Let me show them to you here. With different... Yeah, the alien handlers, so you have four of them. Yeah. Um, what else can I show you? Yes, we have the acolytes, the acolytes, so yeah. So these uh, will go usually with the Vril uh well, the alien Vril you will, will you will have these guys, and we have four of them. So again, let me show them here. And I think that's it. Uh, yes, yeah, some of the minis we haven't shown you yet is the second type of uh, tracking bombers. We only have these guys here, uh, but you will have some others that we will receive soon and I will show them to you as well. I've shown you the rest in the, in the first video, so I think we're done. What I can tell you is uh, if you want to know more uh, about where the production is for Reichbusters, please check out the What's Up Wednesday uh, update that we are publishing every Wednesday, but the, the very last one, the one from today, uh, November uh, 5th, <laughs> uh, is, is uh, giving you all the details 
on production. So you will, you will look at it and you will see. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, very, very excited about Rice Busters. It's coming, guys. It's going to be amazing. Look at all the things you have in just for this project. It's amazing. Okay, thank you. See you. See you soon. Bye bye.